about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know Welcome to Croatia! Now this is an entirely different kind of video which I've yet to bring you yet. Actually, I get asked quite a lot, what else do you do to earn money? Uh, well, I thought I would take you the other side of what I do while my sort of day-to-day, -to -day, as it were, is YouTube and creating content for you guys. I also end up on sets like this as the presenter uh, for new car launches and things like that. Today, we're in Croatia. We're making a commercial, an official Mercedes-Benz commercial for the new A-Class. Honored to be able to bring you this. I have to get all of this sort of stuff signed off because, you know, corporate stuff is really sensitive, but Mercedes has been like, yeah, it'd be incredible if you could make a behind the scenes vlog. So uh, here we are, I'm gonna take you along for the day. Ultimately, let's push some boundaries personally because I normally come up with the words that come out of my mouth just as they appear in my head when I'm driving a car for the first time. But today I've got about four A4 pages of dialogue, which is why the title of this video is all about always challenging yourself. We should talk about that in a minute. About to see the world in action, what we can be, life with no distractions, we'll get away, this is what we need. Have you ever seen that film with Jim Carrey called Yes Man? No. No. You're always making excuses. No. When's the last time you did anything fun? Be a yes man. Yes. Yes. No. You say no to life, and therefore you're not living. You will say... Yes. By saying yes, I have traveled and experienced more of the world in the last two years than I have done in my life prior to that. If I didn't say yes to the amount of opportunities that came my way, I certainly wouldn't be here as a presenter on the set of the new Mercedes-Benz A-Class. I guess... The more that I've done this, the more that I want to sort of be able to share and inspire people to do their own things, whatever that dream might be. When I started this, oh my God, there's a dog on a superbike. I didn't capture that in time, but I promise you there was a poodle on the front of a superbike. Let me see if I can zoom in real quick. On that bike is a dog, I swear. How far in advance do the location scouts come out and try and find these places? Four to six weeks. Yeah, about. four to six weeks. Yeah. It's incredible. Like both both locations we've shot, it's like I've stepped into Photoshop. It's mm -hmm. so, everything's so perfect, yeah. right? Yeah, it's that's incredible. That's why we were filming here. I yeah, think. right. And Croatia is kind of like a secret yeah, space it's like, in yeah. a way. Well, you know? While I've been here and driving around, it's very quiet. There's hardly anyone here. Yeah. And yet it's one of the most beautiful places I've ever been to as a result of saying yes. <laughs> <laughs> so what I meant by being a yes man doesn't mean you've got to jump to like stupid decisions without thinking about it. I just mean it's good to put yourself outside of your comfort zone at times. Take me for example right now, I'm wearing makeup. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, presenting was never my original forte. In fact, it was definitely never the original reason that I got into uh, YouTubing or talking about cars. It's just because I love cars. The byproduct of that is, I think, if you're passionate about something and you can uh, convey your passion through the medium of audio, video, pictures, whatever you're interested in, whatever you think you're best at, just put all of your effort into that. Honestly, like, I'm standing here as I guess proof really that you never know where it might take you. What started as fun and passion has now completely changed my life. And I guess I want to sort of share that mindset with you guys and hopefully give you some inspiration to go out and try your thing. <laughs> On the topic of incredible places, Check this road out. It's like another planet here. On the theme that I was talking about earlier, about location scouts going out and finding the best places. Look at this. Oh my God. I wish it wasn't so far from home. I would shoot here all the time. And the scenery, like the rocks and the foliage and the plants, it's like nothing I've ever really seen. 
so cool. And this is one of the best things about working with people that take you to places you would never have imagined. Anyway, as I'm sure you've gathered, we are now at a different location. I need to go for a quick um, makeup top up and then we're gonna get back on the next scene. This shoot's actually over three days, so it's taking quite a while, but who's gonna complain about being in locations like this? A few days ago, we've just stepped off one shoot, which was, had some ridiculous camera gear. I never thought we'd be able to up it again. Just come and check out this camera before I jump in and do some tracking shots. What is that? I mean, look at it. The whole thing is carbon fiber. And would you believe all of this packs up and you can travel through the airport with that rig there? What? Every shoot I've been on, my camera setup is making me feel so inferior. And now we have this like carbon fiber ultra gimbal. Apparently you can travel up to 200 kilometers an hour with this and it'd still be rock steady. Yeah, unreal. And we're still filming on an Arri, which that camera alone is about 70,000 euros. Just the camera. So that rig there with this whole carbon fiber gimbal, there's, uh, look at this, this is remotely moving and being con like focus controlled from inside the camera car. Yeah, I feel like Tom Cruise. <laughs> okay, while I'm on set and waiting and this car is looking beautiful and not really doing much, I thought I'd run you through this car a little bit. So I'm basically spending most of my time inside the new A-Class. Um, I didn't realize, actually I saw it launched at Geneva last month. That's how new this car is. It was launched last month and now we're here filming the commercial for it. Now, I just wanna say, by the way, I'm not being paid for this vlog. What I am being paid for is to be the presenter of this commercial, but I took it upon myself entirely to make this vlog. It's not part of the deal or anything like that. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys what goes on and hopefully through the yes man thing, uh, hopefully provide some motivation and inspiration to uh, follow whatever you would love to enjoy doing more regularly. Back to the car, the interior on, it's amazing. So what you've got is essentially these two screens here. One side of it, this side here, is actually a touch screen. Let me just see if I can start it up. Yeah, this here is a touch screen, um, but the really interesting feature, the whole new thing about this car, is that you can command it a lot more naturally with your own voice. So rather than talking to it like days of old, where you had to talk to voice commands like a robot, with this car, you can talk to it a lot more like you were talking to an actual human. So let's try an example. Hey Mercedes, change the temperature to 28. I'm setting the temperature to 28 degrees. Yeah, and the list goes on. You can just talk to it like a human, it's mad. What can I do for you? Mm, cancel. Job done. So that's just a brief example of what it can do and the kind of stuff that I've been playing around with lately. But yeah, pretty cool. And the interior, particularly love. These are like turbines, they're like little jet engines for air vents. I think the sculpture inside is really cool. It's just a massive step on from the previous car. This engine that I'm in now is only, it's a 1.3 liter and it's 163 horsepower. So it's not crazy power, uh, but I'm super excited to see how this platform evolves. You are, you are, you are. Right place, right time. <laughs> well, that's a really nice way to uh, arrive in Zadar. So this is our last location of the day, the coastal city of Zadar. It's absolutely gorgeous. Two unique features on this coastline. They have this sort of solar panel artwork installation down there, which absorbs the sun all day, and it has this LED light show in the evening. And then this is something quite unique. There's only two of these in the entire world, which is a sea organ. Basically, the ocean creates waves that bash against these steps, and then these ports here 
generate a melody. And obviously the heavier the waves, the stronger you can hear it. I'm not sure if this is picking it up or not. <laughs> but it's constantly playing a song all day. How cool is that? Yeah, apparently there's one in California, I think, and this is the only other sea organ on the planet in Zadar. If you're in the area, come check it out. We do two different versions. One version is you just step out. Yeah. And the second version is you drive by and step out. Drive by? Yeah. Just step out, drive by, mean, he means like drive coming up to. Drive yeah. up to. Okay, for sure. Yeah. So this is the difference between YouTube and like a full scale production is there's lots of minute little details like focus points so I can't just like pull up anywhere and start filming like we're doing on this it's all like super structured and I've got a piece of chewing gum on the floor there to mark my spot <laughs> it's really professional and I swear just like racing the whole industry is held together with tape <laughs> <laughs> to, lock to lock the car, the lock the car as I walk away uh, exactly talking first then press the button walk away cool that's it maybe yeah. maybe <laughs> Sounds simple, right? Like the amount of takes we do for this thing. It's like, well, maybe you should lock the car and then talk, or maybe talk and then lock the car. And maybe, like, I, I from the car world, I always learned that if you, once you've parked your car, if you don't take one last look as you walk away, you've bought the wrong car. So it's really important for me that as I walk away, I look and recheck the car. Let's do it. Ton, läuft. 86, 87, 3. Action! And action! What an incredible day! What an incredible car! The tech in that thing has blown my mind and the drive in the mountains was out of this world. As always guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Ciao! That's a wrap! I just wanna hold you. I just wanna look into your eyes and tell you that I want you. You know you make me feel so alive. Can't stop thinking about you day and night. Love it when you kiss me, love it when I touch. Every time I'm down here, you Oh, it's a long day. Incredible, but very long. Let me just see if yeah, I can show you the view that I've had from my room the last few days. Look at this. Now, obviously, we've only just managed to get here as the sun's gone down, but you kind of get the picture. It is stunning. But honestly, this is my first time in Croatia, and I am blown away. Like, the beauty, the coast is incredible. The mountains are stunning. The roads through the mountains are even better. Come to Croatia. Seriously, my first time. It's been an intense work schedule, and I've still managed to appreciate how stunning this place is. Okay, so that was that. I mean, I know this has been a totally different take on my usual style of vlogs, but off the back of the video that came before this, where I basically sort of showed you more of a day in the life of what I get up to, the comments and the feedback on that vlog with the new Vantage was really, really cool. And for me, it was really refreshing content. It's the kind of stuff that I love to show you guys. It's the stuff that you kind of don't normally see. I find this, industry sort of goes in waves where for a certain amount of time it's very car focused and it's all kind of reviews and car specific and first drives of new cars but i kind of love showing the wider culture and the wider lifestyle and the stuff that comes with this world because it's crazy like the amount of travel involved the people you meet the things you get up to to be able to share this and upload it to youtube straight away I have never appreciated more than I have today. The last two weeks have been sat with professional production teams. It's a marvel to watch, it, and it is incredible. The time it takes, the dedication, the scripts, the angles, the makeup, just everything. It's just next level intense. And so all of this process, I hope, has shown you the different side of the production world and how lucky we are to have this medium. Anyway, uh, let me know in the comments below. Do you want to be seeing the more wider lifestyle stuff? By no means am I going to be going off cars at all. That's the core of this channel. But 
do you want to see more? And I think that's me dipping my toe in the water, so to speak, over the last few videos. I've really loved bringing it to you. I hope you've enjoyed seeing it as much as I have. Um, after this, I travel back home, meet up with the Vantage in Nice tomorrow, and then drive basically a thousand miles back to the UK for the next adventure. And then I guess the usual programming schedule will return. As always, guys, thanks for watching. I shall see you next time. Ciao.